What's going on everyone? John from the Elite here. This is going to be a very quick video. First, I'm going to show you guys how to set up streamer mode so that way you guys can be shown live in the Elite Discord. I'm going to explain briefly after the setup portion why it's important for you to set these things up. If you want to jump to any particular part of the video, you can go ahead and use the timestamps down below in the description so you can go to the part that you want to check out. All right, I've spoken enough. Why don't we go ahead and just jump right into it. Step one. After you've gone ahead and created your Discord account, you want to go down to the lower left hand side, choose user settings. You want to next go to connections. And then at this point, you want to be sure to add your Twitch account. You also want to try to take advantage of the situation to add any supported social media channels. So if you have a Twitter or if you have a YouTube, maybe you have a Facebook account, you're going to want to add these in here. For now, I'm going to delete my account and I'm going to show you guys how to add it. Step two, in order to add your Twitch account, you want to click the Twitch icon in the upper left hand corner and you'll be redirected to a page where you'll be asked to authorize your account. You may have to type in your credentials in order for this to work. If not, you simply click authorize. Your Twitch account will now be connected to your profile. Step three. Once you've connected your Twitch account, you're going to want to head over on the left hand side down to streamer mode. Here is when you can choose your different streamer mode settings. You can choose to manually enable streamer mode by just clicking this tab here or you can have it set so that it automatically enables or disables whenever you run OBS, XSplit, or any other sort of broadcasting software that gets recognized by Discord. In this case, we want to turn on streamer mode, so I'm going to click this button. And one last bonus tip to show you, if you want a keybind turning on streamer mode, you can head over to the keybind section, click add keybind, down below you'll see an action, you want to choose toggle streamer mode, and you can set your own custom keybind to turn streamer mode on and off from your keyboard. For most Discords that have this set up, whenever you go live, on your Twitch channel, you will be shown with this little purple icon next to your profile picture. In the Elite Discord, this will put you under the active duty section of the Discord. This will tell everyone in the Discord that you are currently live and that they can click there to go check you out. You can click the profile picture name and click watch to head straight to the channel. And that, my friends, is how you set up streamer mode. All right, so now we gotta get to the part where I have to explain why it is that you wanna enable the streamer mode functionality. If it already wasn't apparent to you about what this helps you do, is that it helps other members of the Elite Discord or even other Discord in general, tell them when you're live. This can help possibly bring some more viewership into your stream. And this seems to be kind of like the more obvious thing too. But there are some other reasons why you might want to not just connect your Twitch account, but also some of your other various social media accounts. Let's say I'm in the Discord here and I want to just find someone's particular social media channels. Maybe I haven't followed them on, on Twitter before or I, I don't know where their Facebook account is. For now, I have to disable streamer mode in order to show you this. But I want to go ahead and right click on someone's name, click profile, and then if they have any connected accounts, they'll be listed down here below. This is great if you want to try to find someone's social media channels when they might not be available. Now, streamer mode, unfortunately, isn't a perfect thing. Um, and what I mean by that is when it comes to showing you as in the active duty section of the Discord, unfortunately, sometimes uh, you may not be showing as live in the active duty section. There isn't really a whole lot that can be done with it, but a couple of things you could try. You can try disabling and then re-enabling streamer mode. You could also try restarting Discord, and you could also try reconnecting your account. So while you're using streamer mode and while you're going live, it probably doesn't hurt every now and then to just check your Discord if you're having problems to make sure that you're staying in streamer mode. And be sure you're reading a your chat too, because sometimes an elite member will pop in to let you know that you're not showing as live. And sometimes that can help out. And honestly, that's, that's about it. There's really not much to it. If you found the video helpful, please be sure to like, share, and comment down below. Feel free to leave some feedback in the comments and let us know what your experience has been like setting up streamer mode. Also, be sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon for notifications to stay up to date with anything that goes on on the Elite YouTube channel. And if you're not a part of the Elite and you happen to discover this video, why don't you consider joining our Elite Academy Discord? There's a great community of people there that would love to get to know you. It's a great opportunity to network, learn some better streaming advice. We want to help each other grow. We want to help each other become better streamers overall. So be sure to join the Elite Academy today so you can start your journey in becoming the very best. Appreciate you all taking the time to check out this video. Thank you for watching and have a pleasant day, everybody.